Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are doing great today. I am here to do a craft with me video. Um, I want to do a master board and I am using, um, I want to make it because I'm working on a journal, a gratitude journal that I want to start working, uh, doing for um, next month, for the month of November. And the papers that I am going to be using is from Maggie Holmes and it is the Marigold collection. And um, I don't have the paper pad with me, I left it in my other room. Um, I'm currently recording in my dining room because that's where all the lights is at. So, um, but anyways, this is what I started. I used this as a cover and I have an idea on how I'm gonna decorate it. And um, I had purchased these little corners from book corner book cover corners from Amazon and they're very lightweight uh, you get a lot I can't remember I think I'm not sure it was 50 or a hundred pieces <coughs> but uh, they're very lightweight and very easy to use you just use flat nose pliers uh, to crimp it and um, and yeah so that's what I use for the corners of my journal and then there's actually about eight pages in here so here's the front cover, and then this is uh, tea dyed or coffee dyed paper. This is from A Trace of Sparkle. I have purchased the pack from her, and of course, Ashes had to take a chomp at, at it. Um, this, uh, this pink one, blue one, and then green one, and I think I have a yellow one. This is from uh, from Chiquis, from uh, Chiquita Crochet here on YouTube. Hi, Chiquis. And then, um, so here's the paper. This is another one. So I got, I think, three of them, including the cover. And then this is my dyed, my coffee dyed paper. And then here's, this is mine, and I did an oopsie. Um, I cut it a little bit shorter. I meant to cut it at eight. Um, I meant to cut it at eight and a half, and I cut it at six and a half, I believe. So and then um, I just taped it, since it's for me. So it's no big deal. So I just taped it. And so this is how it looks. This paper is also from Chiquita Crochet. I purchased the pack from her. And then I, when I realized it, I cut it like right up to here. <laughs> but so, yeah, I taped it. Yeah, so this is a really pretty, pretty green color. And um, yeah, this is beautiful right here. So beautiful. But anyways, so this is what I'm gonna be using. And I know there's 30 days. <clears throat> 30 or 31, 31 days in November, or 30 days in November, I can't remember, but anyways, <laughs> there's eight pages of this, and I'm gonna add <clears throat> flips and tucks and things like that, so, so yeah, so, um, I have, I did some embossing, and, um, I have everything here in the box that I want to use, so, I have these stickers, um, these papers that I purchased from Timu a while back. Um, I have these stickers from Maggie Holmes Marigold. I have these also that are Marigold. So um, I purchased this recently from Timu. Didn't do a haul video because it was barely anything and all I had purchased was just stickers. I thought a lot of these images went well with the collection. So I got that to work with. Here are some um, some embossed paper that I did. This is from Michaels, these uh, shimmering ones, really pretty. I love the design. And that is this design right here. Beautiful. I think I got this from, um, I think I got it from Timo. Um, can't remember because it's been a while. So I did three of those in these colors. And then this one, um, it's a butterfly one. And I think I got it from Timo. As this one, I definitely got it from Timo because it's really thick. And these are butterflies, really pretty. So I did three colors. And this is shimmer paper from Michaels. And then this one, I really love how this looks because the paper has got white core. And so it's green and then you see the white core of it. It is so beautiful. And this is a script, um, it's a script one. And it's also from Timo. And I did these, this one, and this one. So yeah, so okay, so those are my diet, my embossed papers. Um, so I have that to work with. And then I also have this tissue paper. Um, don't remember where I got it. Someone, I think someone gave it to me, so I'm gonna use this as well. 
and then um, I have some the, some of this uh, vintage paper and then I have a lot of scraps from when I did my um, my flip-flop journal last year so I have a lot of scraps that I can work with as well so yeah and if you haven't seen that um, video I will put the link down below in the description box um, it was a fun project I mean I was looking at it the other day and I'm like oh, I want to make another one <laughs> so alrighty so let me go ahead and share with uh, start what I'm gonna be using so here I have um, cardstock this is beige cardstock which I really don't use and I have um, some ephemera that I purchased from Miss Catitude uh, on Instagram and then um, I have some kind of call these also ephemera which actually I'm going to use that in the journal itself but then I have all these scraps that I would like to use um, for my board so um, let me see let me start pulling out some scraps I definitely want to use this polka dot one let's see this one I think the black and white I'll use it with the with the oh these are pretty I like that I like this one too maybe this one do I have a smaller one yeah I do I got a smaller one mm, definitely use this um oh. I'll use my music paper that I have I have this one I got this one too this one alrighty oh I got this paper I could use that paper okay so here are some of the scraps that I want like to use so I hope you guys are doing well it'll be a little chatty video okay so what am I gonna start with alrighty let's start with let me go through all my scraps here okay I got some dyed paper as well that I'm just gonna include some green one and I have some embossed paper that I did last time as well. I could use these white ones. I have this one for something else. Alrighty. Okay, let me see. Let's get started. Oh. Alrighty. So I'll do some music. Music here Let's see this one or this way I like this one So yeah, it's been a while since I've done a junk journal. I did a scripture writing plan journal um, last year in May. I meant to pull it out and show it you guys. But if you haven't seen that video as well, I will link it down below. And I had so much fun um, working on that journal. That's you know, because it was it was um it was a scripture writing plan that was created by. Um, by Nanda and she's uh, apple of his eye by Nanda on Instagram and um, it was about the book of Proverbs and um, <clears throat> walking in wisdom and that was such a great study it was such a great study I enjoyed it so much I know in my community tab I have a few um, a few pictures that I posted um, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this um with this journal next month i know i won't be posting every single day but um you know as i study god's word on this um i will go ahead and if i feel led that if there's something that really stood out to me that i learned and i really enjoyed um that i would like to share then i will go ahead and uh, do a video, you know, possibly a voiceover because I haven't done a voiceover and I've never done a voiceover So I have no idea how to How to do one so um, Possibly I'll do a voiceover and um, 
and yeah I'll share what I learned you know as I'm creating so I'll do like a craft with me video and um, I could just you know share what I've created uh, what I learned from God's Word because you know God's Word feel, you know feeds the soul um, the Bible does say that man should not live on bread alone but uh, from every word that comes out of the mouth of God so it's really important to be in his word and I feel convicted right now because um, I haven't really been um, you know um, diligently uh, in the Bible in the Bible as I should and um, and you know I have to remember that as a that I should not condemn myself nor um, feel condemned because that's not of God and um, but I am so happy that at least I we have Bible study for a couple of days I you know I'm able to um, be in God's Word and study in preparation for our weekly Bible study that's that we have um, via zoom and I'm so glad for technology because right now my husband is recovering from surgery and uh, so I'm not able to go to the sister's house, you know, to, um, you know, to fellowship and, and to be in the word with them and stuff. But at least I could do it through Zoom and it's recorded. So, um, you know, if we miss it one day or something because of family or an emergency or whatnot, uh, we could at least um, uh, rewatch it. So that's, that's good. Uh, and yeah, so... So like I was saying, I do, I was feeling convicted as I was thinking about doing this video and sharing and stuff. So, um, but yeah, like I said, it's not, it's not from God and God gives us grace and um, we're not to abuse his grace, um, but he does gives us grace and, and, uh, we should show ourselves, uh, grace, uh, as well. So anyways, um, so this, I feel like it will help me uh, to, um, to be in his word, you know, to, uh, to study and be fed, you know, spiritually. So, but yeah, like I said, I enjoy doing this. I love doing this. Um, you know, working on journals, I usually do, uh, this is too much, let me see, I think I'm going to start working, yeah, I'll do some dyed paper, um, I do, I love doing creative journaling, I enjoy that so much, so, um, I'm going to do this, and, so yeah, let's see, like that. I couldn't find my bigger <clears throat> glue stick. I was like looking for it. Why well, I didn't really look for it? Because I would have to go through three bins to try to find find it. And <clears throat> I remember that when I went through those bins, I couldn't find it. Um, I will. I didn't see it as I was preparing for this. You know, <clears throat> going through the bins so I could work on this. So yeah. <coughs> okay, I'll put that there. It's been so gloomy outside. It was raining. I didn't even expect rain this evening or last night. It started raining like at 3 o'clock in the morning. And I only knew because my daughter woke, woke me up. So I went to check on her to see why she was so angry because I didn't hear it. And, um, and yeah, it was because it was raining. Oh. I like this butterfly right here and I think this is from this this one was from um, from Jennifer a trace of sparkle this is the one that she she created and I purchased from her so you do have to check her out if you don't know who she is she does some beautiful beautiful journals and I've been binge watching her channel especially her um, mask making videos because um, I have a few things in mind that I would like to create for my journal so she, my journal will be a lot of um, her inspiration and as well as others that I follow so yeah 
let's see. I like this one. Let's see. Yeah. And now I'm running out of battery already. When I turned this on, I was like, what? Oh, I didn't see if how much battery I had. So tell me in the comments what you guys been up to, what you guys been creating. I had originally thought about um, working on some Christmas projects, but then I changed my mind. <laughs> I was like, no, I think I want to do this instead, you know. So I did four, so let me see. I'm going to do some of this. Um, you know, I think I'm going to start working on the, on the scraps. Let's see. Okay, so I definitely want to do these geese. These geese are so cute. So now we have little parakeets. If you guys haven't, if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, um, I have little parakeets. They're such characters. They're so hilarious. And they love to drive Ashes insane. Um, they're still babies. They're probably about six months old or so. And um, <laughs> they're so funny. And my granddaughter named them Squawkers and Squeakers. Um, I'm like, Squawkers and Squeakers. And I, sometimes I can't figure out who's who. And um, so I'm like, how about blueberry and pepino? You know, pepino in Spanish means uh, cucumber because we have, um, oh my gosh, my glue dripped. Um, oh, I didn't put too much glue and I didn't bring a napkin. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah. So I'm like, why not pepino and blueberry? <laughs> squawkers and squeakers sound so complicated. And she's like, no, I like squawkers and squeakers. I'm like, okay, squawkers and squeakers it is. And, um, but yeah, they're so cute. And um, they like to share uh, Ash's uh, food. And it's so funny because, um, oh, I like this right here because it's right at the edge. Um, yeah, they like to share Ash's food. And, but it's Squawkers. Squawkers is the blue one. He's, um, he is the one that's brave enough to go to Ash's bowl and start pecking at his lettuce because we give him lettuce for breakfast and for dinner. So there, he's a spoiled rabbit. And, um, so yeah, and <laughs> it's so funny. He's just so adorable. Oh, I like this, like this right here. And um, let's see. Okay. I don't like that white showing right there. This is coming along. I like how this is looking. Alrighty, let me do this. Alrighty. I'll put it like this. I think it's easier. I still have glue in my hands. Let's see. This one still has it's not there. It should, yeah. Alrighty, let's see what else. Some um, I think we'll put some some green. Oh, I think I'll do some green. I think I like this one. So yeah. figure out where should I put the I think right there so it's not so solid so I don't know I think I'm gonna create some tags and
try to mimic some of the stuff that I made with my last journal. Because I I love that journal. I gave it away already, but um it was such a beautiful journal. It's not this is not gonna be as you can tell it's not gonna be so well who knows? Maybe it might be really thick because it's 30 days of scripture writing. So okay, I did that. Oh, let's see. Let's do oh I like this pink one. Let's do this old pink one. Oh no, wrong way. Let me go this way. Trying to look at my clock to make sure it doesn't. Yeah. I don't want for it to to turn off on me without knowing. It looks like I have one bar left. So hopefully. Oh, this is too thick. Okay, let me do this again. I found this glue in my drawer. I don't know what glue it is. It's a little watery. But it's doing the job. Okay, let me do this. It's really watery. You could probably hear my husband in the background. He's acting goofy. Here, let me try to use this one. Alrighty, let's see. What else? What else? Um, I think I'll use this polka dot. Or maybe I'll use this one. This one's got pink in it. No, it's not pink, but still. I could probably use it right here. I guess he doesn't want to hear me. He closed the door. Let me know if you guys would be interested. Let the shut off somewhere because it's restarted again. But let me know if you guys would be interested in doing in me continue doing craft me craft with me videos. Um because sometimes <laughs> crafting by myself is a little lonely. I like it like this. Right there. And, and you know what? I could use this. Oh, I don't have my paper trimmer. Oh, but this. I could use these um, brand strips. To use as washi tape. I like that. Yeah, I'll do that. I like that. Let's see. Let me do it. I think that looks cute. Let it breathe. Oh my goodness, yeah, it's so wet. Let me do that again. Hopefully it'll stick. I have my barely art glue, but um the nozzle is so narrow. It's as narrow as this. What can you see? It's as narrow as this one, but it gets the it clogs up a lot. So um Oh, here's this one. I like this one. This branding strip. Hmm. Or maybe should I do more pink? I'm not sure. Anyways. Um, I'm going to do this one. I think I'll do a small... Maybe I'll do it here. Yeah. Do that there. Do that there. Let's see. I like that. Yeah. It's 
coming along. It's coming along. What else can I put? Oh, I like this printing strip. The stars. I mean stars. What is this? Bows. Use it as bows. Can I put this? Oh, I can put it right there. Yes, yes, yes. Put that there. Probably put this one here. I like that right there. Put that right there. And then the screen one over here. That's cute. Alrighty. Oh, mail lady just got here. Maybe work on some of this. Yeah. I'll put that there to cover that little spot. This one right here. I don't want to see this one. Oh, I'm not sure. Oh, I got I got, got this one, but hmm, maybe embossed. Uh, let me see. I got my embossed papers right. Where did I put it? Oh, here they are. I think I'm going to put, well, I should do two more of those because I already did one. And I like to work in threes. And I did, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, I got a lot of that here. Let me do this one. Let's see, yeah, I got too much dye paper together. You know what? That's okay. That's okay. Let's see. I'll put it right here. I'll put that right there. I'll need one more, and that one more I'll probably put this one here. Let's see. There. So I'll put that one. Let's see. I'll put it right here.
you know what? I think I'm gonna do the white, the green scripts because that one was very beautiful. I love how it looked. This one. I'm gonna do that right here. Yeah. And it tears easily too. Look at that. I love it. Hmm. Yeah, right there. I'm gonna do that. This one, I could do a small little piece. I could put that right there. Coming along. And then I'll put another piece there. Okay, so I think I'm going to use a tissue paper that I have here. Um, trying to see. No. Okay, I think I'll use this tissue paper. Uh, let's see, I like the music notes. Actually, it's not tissue. I think it's rice paper. That's what it feels like. Hmm. Let's see. Feels like rice paper. Okay, well, I'm gonna use that. And let me go ahead and put this here. Oh, this got stuck. Alrighty. Alrighty, let's see. Let's put that right there. Then, let's see. Hmm. I'll put that right there. Let's 
so it goes right here although the, the C kind of came off in the end too but that's okay so all this is covered I need something here and here and a little bit of there um, let's see I think I'll put some music paper here I wish I remembered who gave me this. I like this letter right here. That one's nice. All right, let's put this right here. And okay, I got some stickers. I have this from the sticker book that I got from Timu. Because I could probably fill in some spaces like this green one. These green ones, this one too. Put some greenery. I think I'll put some greenery. This is blue. Green and orange. Huh, I think this one. Oh, it doesn't. I, I need scissors with this. It's not pre cut. Alrighty, that's a fail. So let me see what I could do with this one. So I can put the sticker. Sticker right there. Florals. Um, uh, maybe right there. I like this postage. This postage. Maybe too much green. How about the little squirrel? She's cute. I'll put the squirrel right there. Postage I'll put right here. In this corner. I mean right there. And let's see. I feel like I need something in this area here. Let's put the ducky right there. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, I think this for now. Should I put, oh, I got some more florals over here. But I don't know where to put it. Oh, in this corner. I need something in that corner. Um, let's see. Hmm. I need something that's long enough. Maybe one of these flowers. This was from Timu. And I pulled it out because I thought it would look great. As a matter of fact, it does. I think I'll put this yellow one right there. And I'll just have to trim around. Yes, yes, yes. I like that. Now if I could just find where to peel it. All 
Alrighty. All done. So I just need to trim this out. I don't have my scissors, but I have this nail trimmer thingy, so let's see if that works. No, it's not sharp, sharp enough. But anyways, um, so yeah, this is my finished um, master board that I've created. So, um, so I'm going to cut it up. I'm going to uh, trim around the edges and clean it up and stuff. And then um, I'm going to cut it up and make it into tags or whatnot. So, so yeah, so thanks a lot for watching. My battery's about to run dead right now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time. Bye.